Take care of Anion Karaba for me, Percy. I will, Thomas. Make sure you keep the trucks in order. Cheer up, Thomas. You're not alone. I'll be there with you. Don't forget, we're allies now. Let's do our best to keep the yards in tip-top shape. You're right. Let's get to work. So, Thomas, how was your trip down the main line? Oh, it was lovely. It is nice to see the rest of the island for a change. Though, will the yard be okay if neither of us there? Oh, don't worry, Thomas. I'm sure James, Henry and Edward are capable of shunting their own trains. I'm not sure about Henry. Coaches? We have enough of those, don't we? Why do we need more? No, no, Thomas. Look at them. Those look much more fancier than the express coaches. Something special must be happening. Ah, Thomas and Gordon. Sir? sir. I see the important train has arrived safely. It has, sir. Thanks to Thomas and sir. What are those fancy coaches for? Ah, I was about to tell you. This evening, I have a very important announcement to make. So make sure the both of you are at the sheds by then. Yes, sir. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a meeting to attend in the works. It's already getting quite late, sir. Are you sure you can make it to Tinworth in time? Oh, don't worry, Thomas. My car is very fast. We should make our way back. Quite right. Will the fat controller make it in time? What do you mean? He's right there. Wait, what? That was quick. Boss, my buffers! What's going on? Shh! The fat controller is going to tell us now. Ladies, gentlemen, and engines, I am honored to inform you that Her Majesty the Queen herself will be coming here to visit us. Now, on with the preparations. I wonder who will pull the royal train? I'm too old to pull important trains. I'm in disgrace. Even if I wasn't in disgrace, I couldn't pull it anyway. Well, it's obvious, isn't it? If neither of you lot can pull it, then clearly the fat controller will choose me, of course. Ha! I doubt it, honestly. Do you really think the fat controller will let you pull important trains after you slip down the hill of the express? Oh, shut up! I don't want to hear that from the engine who got kicked off the express because he jumped into a ditch. Say what you want, little James. But we wouldn't want the royal train sliding down the hill, do we? In any case, Henry has a better chance of pulling it than the both of us. What? Huh? Well, it would be nice, I guess. In your dreams, you can't even jump your own train without derailing something. Everything inside will shatter the second you touch the royal coaches. It's just way too risky. Well, 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 who do you think should pull it then? Not you, that's for sure. <laughs> that idiot. What does he know? I can shut my own train. I'll show him. I'll show him. Are you sure you want to do this on your own, Henry? 
If this is about what James said a few days ago, you really shouldn't let his words get to you. Oh, don't worry, Thomas. This has nothing to do with him. I have to take the initiative, you know. I can't rely on you to shut my trains forever. Well, take care then. Gordon, has James collected his train yet? Not yet, I'm afraid. I think he's still being washed. I swear, that idiot needs to pick up the slack. All right, time to prove James wrong. You're doing good, old boy. I know, John. The fact controller might even let me pull the rail train at this rate. I wouldn't go that far. Wait a minute. This is... <gasps> Stop! We're on the wrong track. Oh, no. What did I say? What did I say? He knows he's horrible and shunting his own trains, yet he does it anyway. I don't even know why he bothers trying. James, a man just got hurt. Have some sympathy. Don't worry. It's Barry. I know him. I'm sure he's okay somehow. Barry? Barry! Are you alright? Yes, Ted. I'm fine. You silly great engine, why don't you watch where you blow that smoke of yours? Paint doesn't grow on trees, you know. Just look at you. You're not a pretty picture. What's not a pretty picture? Oh. <laughs> you look like a nice cake, Henry. I'm going to fetch some new paint. This is just great. I was doing so nicely, too. <clears throat> I'm very disappointed in you, Henry. The chefs won't be pleased once they hear what happened to the buffet carriage. How did this happen? Well, well, well... I got distracted, sir. It's partly my fault too, sir. I was... also distracted. I might have known. Well, it's best you get that dome painted over as soon as possible. I'm afraid we can't do that, sir. Why ever not? We're out of green paint, sir. We've used the rest to paint the sheds. Well. Order oh, some more then. We can't, sir. The workers at the paint factory have gone on strike. You know, Henry, I was actually considering asking you to pull the royal train, but I'm afraid I can't do that anymore. Wait, what? I'm sorry, Henry, but we can't have you picking up the queen looking like that. I'll have to make other arrangements. Now, who do I get to pull the royal train now? We won't go! We won't go! Oh, shut up! <laughs> sir! Sir! Yes, Henry? I think there's someone who deserves to pull the royal train. <gasps> there he is! Now's our chance! Please, please sir. sir! One at a time, please. Yes, Gordon. May Thomas have his branch line back? Hmm. Thomas? Can Gordon pull coaches again? Hmm. I can see that you've both learned your lessons. And you've both worked very hard in the yard these past few months. And so, you deserve a treat. When the Queen comes, Edward will go in front and clear the line, Thomas will look after the coaches, and Gordon... Yes, sir? You will have the honour of pulling the royal train. <gasps> Do you really mean that, sir? I'm not finished. 
And then, after the Queen's visit is over, Thomas, you can go back to your branch line. And Gordon, you'll be allowed to pull coaches again. Yes! Oh, sir! Thank you so much, sir! Congratulations, Gordon! We did it, Gordon. Yes, we did, Thomas. <laughs> Ted, what are you doing? Covering the white paint. What? Ted, there's no point. Just leave it there. It's showing me. We have work to do. Ready to pick up the Queen, Gordon? Readier than I ever was, Edward. Alright, that's all the coaches. Time to join the others. Have fun, you two. I look forward to returning to the branch line after tomorrow. We will! Oh, Thomas. Glad you could join us. It's almost time for Gordon to arrive. Isn't it exciting? I can't believe the VAC controller actually chose Gordon in the end. Whoever suggested it to him must have been an absolute dunce. It should have been me. Cheer up, James. Gordon's been stuck with goods trains for months now. He deserves it after all the hard work he's done. You're even worse. You should be worrying about what the Queen might say about that splash of white on you. She's not going to care. I'll... The Queen is here! The Queen is here! Gordon's, Gordon's here. here! Gordon's, Gordon's here. here! Gordon looks fantastic! He really does! It's just white buffers. What difference does it make? Shut up, James. The Queen was met by the Fat Controller, and before doing anything else, she thanked him for such a splendid ride. Not at all, Your Majesty. Thank you. We have read a great deal about your engines. May we see them, please? Right this way, Your Majesty. The, the Queen's, Queen's coming! coming. The, the Queen's, Queen's coming! coming. Shh, be quiet. Shh, shut up, Percy. But Toby and Percy were too excited to care. The Fat Controller told the Queen their names. And she talked to each engine. The next day, the Queen spoke specially to Thomas, who fetched her coaches. And to Edward and Gordon, who took her away. Three cheers for Gordon and the Queen! Hip hip! Hip hip! Hip hip!